Falling in love again Never wanted to What am I to do? Can't help I'm going to make some white scones today from our white scone mix and first of all you preheat your oven to 200 degrees or gas mark 6. Now I've emptied the scone mixture into the bowl but I've kept back a little bit for when I'm rolling out the scones to dust underneath them. So we have our mix in the bowl. I've my milk in the jug 225 mils. I have an egg that I'm going to crack into the milk and we add the milk, the egg to the milk and just give it a little like this. We leave that there now. This is my 25 grams of butter and I'm going to rub this into the flour mixture. Like so, so you rub this in with your fingertips not too heavy so as to have the mixture nice and light so I mix this in until it resembles fine breadcrumbs and we'll make a little well in the center and I'll add the egg and the milk now you mix this in quite slowly and when it all comes together into a soft dough, not too soft. We'll mix this now and gather in all the flour. I'm adding a little bit of the mixture, the flour out of the bag now to bring the dough together. So I'll make it into a nice little ball. And I turn it out onto the flour board. We put some of the flour here. And we'll scrape out the bowl. And knead the mixture very lightly, just to bring it together into a nice ball. Now you can flatten it out with your hands this way or if you have a rolling pin just dust it with a little bit of flour and just roll it out until it's about uh, half an inch thick. And then I have my scone cutter and we'll cut out the scones. So I just this way. And you can dip the scone cutter in the flour. It'll make the scones easier to cut. You dip them in the bag. If it's otherwise, if it's a bit wet, it's inclined to stick. Now I'll put those scones that I've cut out. I put them on the grease tray. A bag will normally make, it'll make about 12 scones. Now, before I put them in the oven, I have kept back some of the milk and the egg mixture, and I'm using a brush, and I'm going to brush over the top of the scones, and this gives them a nice glazed, shiny look when they're baked. So I'll just rub them over, just brush them on the top. If you, 
you have um, some of the egg mixture left over, that's fine. If you haven't, you can just use ordinary milk. So now we have our 12 scones ready and we'll pop them in the oven for about 10-15 minutes at 220 or gas mark 6. Now the scones have been in the oven for about 12, 14, 15 minutes and they're done. And we'll pop them out onto the tray and let them cool in the wire tray. So here we are. 